Brandon. Nice Hi. to meet you. How are you? Ooh, nice your jewelry you. is so oh, thank cool. Thank you. Thank you very much. So stand-up comedy sounds so terrifying to yes, me. Yes, I know. Did you, have you ever experienced that or did you pre- like do a lot of preparation for it? I had never experienced it. I've always been a fan. Um, I've always been a casual observer, I guess. Um, and I've always had a lot of admiration and respect for what they do because it seems so difficult to me. Um, and I think that's part of why I wanted to do it was because it seemed like such an incredible challenge and something really outside of my comfort zone because I'm not really even a very good public speaker or not good at giving a toast or anything. I just kind of eat crumble. So it seemed like a way for me to at least stretch myself and try something new. And and now even more so, I just have so much respect for them because I think it's, not only is it nerve-wracking to get up there in front of people, but to be able to sort of guide an audience and to have them in the palm of your hand going, you know, to, to a dark place, to a light place, and then back again, um, takes a lot of skill. It takes a lot of skill. And I, I, I don't think I necessarily mastered that but I think I hope that I, I got it right enough to get by you know as an actor playing a character in a movie yeah. you know I'm sure you did <laughs> Thank you. and your character I feel the film is uh, equal parts comedy and this emotional you know very dramatic side was one more difficult to play than the other I think I was more I was more nervous about the comedy because that was more outside of, of what I do I think for me when something is really well written and truthful the emotional stuff although it's daunting and it's incredibly important to me to get it right it's I guess in some ways um, it's less nerve-wracking because I know as long as I just connect to it and I understand it like it'll be okay whereas with the comedy there's so many more skill sets that I had to had to learn in order to be able to do that that I didn't have before necessarily so, so that part was a little bit scarier to me did you learn anything about yourself while playing Nina well I mean I, I think I I gained a little bit of confidence I think I I tried a lot of new things that I'd never tried before in lots of ways. I mean, in the comedy and also emotionally and physically, I'm a bit more stripped down than I've been in, in other things. And so the vulnerability of that was was new and, and, and pushed me to new places. And so um, I think anytime you do that, you come out feeling a little bit stronger. So, so I certainly appreciate that experience. Yeah, very good. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.